coming to the next coming to the next page neither her owner nor her mother was around now he looked around he saw that there was no owner of this goat and the mother also was not around why because it was a small goat it was a baby goat and it was uh, the mother was not around this little goat she continued to nudge me what what is what is the meaning of nudge push gently he was sitting she continued to nudge me she was pushing gently on him so i looked in my pockets for nourishment now he was saying that i looked in my pocket for something to eat so that i can give to that small goat and finding a ginger biscuit held it out to her now when he found this ginger biscuit he held it out to her and she ate it with relish i have explained you the meaning of relish what is relish something which is very favorite to you and you eat it with happiness you eat it with happiness that is you eat with relish in other words you can also speak i ate the chocolate with relish okay so relish i've already told uh, sh- uh, eating with happiness enjoying that enjoying whatever you are eating so uh, this biscuit which this writer has given to this small goat she ate it with relish she was very happy she ate it with relish with enjoyment and with happiness then sat down beside me and began nibbling at the grass now what is nibbling nibbling is biting softly nibbling is biting softly so uh, this goat it started nibbling at the grass a little later when i got up to leave and goat rose too now when he got up this goat also it also got up and when i started walking home she followed me unsteadily her thin legs taking her this way and that way that means that baby was very unsteady that baby was uh, maybe that baby goat it started walking uh, like just a few days before maybe and it was it was that is why it was unsteadily unsteadily means one is steadily steady is bahut hi aaram se bahut hi confidence ke sath hai unsteadily is without confidence means uh, you will see that it is about to fall the baby chhota sa baby human baby walk karna shuru karta hai it walks unsteadily means we feel like abhi wo gir jayega same way this small goat it started walking unsteadily and started following this writer go home i said as she danced around me now she was dan- no, she was not literally dancing matlab she means she was uh, walking here and there when he was walking he was uh, this goat was also walking uh, with him some kabhi idhar kabhi udhar if you have seen a dog following you how the dog uh, does understood the same way this way this goat was also doing but she followed me to the river bed okay now came the river she followed me to the river bed it was obvious that her trembling legs would not stand up to the current now he is thinking that it was obvious that this river is uh, it has a uh, heavy current heavy current not that that electric current means the waves jo pani ki waves hote hain that is very very strong and this small goat will uh, go away with the river so he said he thought that this um, when i'll cross this when i'll start crossing this river this goat will obviously come after me so this will also this goat will not be able to resist that water current and maybe it will go away with the river matlab ye kya pata beh jayegi barish uh, sorry not barish uh, this river with that so he took so i took her in my arms and carried her across the stream when i set her down she remained by my side rubbing against my legs means she was not ready to leave the boy she was not ready to leave the boy i set out for home at a brisk pace at a brisk pace very quick very quick pace feeling sure that i would soon leave the little goat behind now he was now he started remembering that i have to reach home as early as possible so he started walking at a brisk pace so that that goat will be remained behind but her legs were stronger than i had supposed now he is saying that i thought that her legs were not stronger it was a baby goat so 
he started walking fast thinking that he uh, the uh, goat will be left behind but she was more uh, she was stronger her legs were stronger and he he was amazed he was surprised she came hopping along right up to the gate of our house now when he has reached he she came hopping along right up to the gate of our house there was nothing i could do but carry her in and present her to grandfather now he is saying that there was no choice for me now i have to carry her and take it to the grandfather not another pet now who is saying this said the grandmother grandmother she is irritated she is saying not another pet when she saw the goat on the veranda lapping a saucer of milk means maybe that boy has given a milk in a saucer you know what is a saucer cup in a saucer a small plate maybe he has given a milk to that goat and she was drinking and at that time the grandmother saw in the veranda that little goat now she is irritated she is angry she is saying no not another pet i have go- i have told you both of you again and again that i will not tolerate any sorry i will not tolerate another animal in the house now she is saying that i have told you again and again both of you the grandfather and the boy that i will not tolerate any other pet in this house